Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be playing with a new ColourPop drop. It's probably not new by now, but I got their, what is it called? By the Rose eyeshadow palette and the Super Shock shadow trio that comes with it. So don't forget to like this video, hit that subscribe button, and also turn on the bell so that way you get notified every time I upload a brand new video, and let's get started. This is the box for the eyeshadow palettes. Really, really cute and pretty. This is what the eyeshadow palette looks like. Super cute. Looks honestly very like Valentine's Day to me. And then the trio of Super Shocks. The main reason why I wanted to try this collection, it's not anything... How do, how do I say it without being rude? It's not anything fantastic that I haven't seen before, but I have not tried uh, ColourPop eyeshadows or their Super Shock shadows. Super, super Shock shadows. Um, but I wanted to try them because I hadn't tried them yet. Does that make sense? I hadn't tried anything from ColourPop other than their lip liners, so I bought this little two-piece, I guess technically four-piece set because I wanted to try ColourPop formula. This is what the Super Shock shadows come in. It is like a little sleeve. And it's got the three colors in there. Excuse the kids screaming outside. It's a snow day, so they're going nuts. Oh, it looks like I might have had a casualty in this one. There we go. Yeah, it's definitely broken, but we'll we can still use it. Okay, so I'm going to do my brows and prime my eyes off camera, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have my brows on. They are very <laughs> aggressive today for some reason. And then I did my eye base. I haven't set my eye base. I think it should be fine though. I may actually set it with the lightest shade in this palette. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take the lightest shade in the palette. It's called a Picnic Basket. Honestly, it looks like a highlighting shade for me. Let me blend out my creases first. I hear nothing but amazing things about ColourPop, so I'm hoping I like this. Okay, so I dusted the lightest shade. It's called Picnic Basket. This one right here, all over my lid, and then I'm going to take this one, which is called Sunday... Sunday Soiree. Soiree. I, I give up. I'm not gonna. No. I just. Nope. I'm gonna pick that up on a M441. I'm gonna start dusting that in my crease. So far it's blending very beautifully and the color payoff is very nice. Okay, so now I'm gonna take, nope, not even gonna try to say that one, this shade right here. I'm going to pick that up using a M433 and we're going to do the same thing but a little bit lower. Slowly but surely darkening it up.
so now that we got that I think about as dark as it can go I'm gonna go ahead and dip into savor it it's this shade right here and I'm gonna be using a M456 so far everything's blending beautifully and I'm kind of pissed at myself for not trying ColourPop sooner as much people like as much as people like talk it up all the time, you know? Okay. And again, repeating the same step, but trying to keep most of this pigment like right here. Just trying to go super, super slow. just gonna take the Sunday Soiree, however you say that, the lighter pink shade, and I'm gonna go around the edges just to make sure that everything is cohesive. So that looks really awesome. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a shimmer shade on my lid and then I will top off with one of the super shock shadows. Or do these look good by themselves? I don't know. See, I've never tried ColourPop stuff, so I don't know if the super shocks actually have pigment behind them or are they just shimmer. So let me just watch it yeah see it's mainly just a shimmer it's gorgeous but it's mainly just a shimmer so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take I think I'm gonna use a uh, cheers babe this one smack dab in the middle I'm just gonna pick it up with my finger and I'm gonna start placing that on my lid Okay. ColourPop didn't have to throw me off like that. Okay, that was way too freaking nice. I think this is like a $9 freaking eyeshadow palette, okay? This is stunning. Wow. See this right here, I didn't want to buy the whole kit and caboodle when it came to that launch, the rosé launch, because I never tried any of their stuff and I didn't want to drop an ass ton of money if it wasn't going to be good. But that's freaking amazing. That's gorgeous. makes me so pissed at myself for not trying their stuff sooner oh my god just this palette in general 100% recommend the price is amazing but even I would expect this quality even from normal brands like normal like mid-tier brands not even just the cheap brands Wow okay so I'm gonna wipe off my finger and I'm gonna top it with the super shock shadow of course the one that's broken is the one i want to use it's called it's a vibe oh please don't fall out but that's what it looks like it's all crushed up though because it broke apparently i'm just gonna grab that up with my finger 
and I'm going to place it on this eye so that we can see the difference. Wow. Okay. So, subtle difference, but wow. Especially because I already had like a shimmer shade down that already blew my mind. This is like Valentine's Day. Like, this is what I would want to wear for Valentine's Day. So freaking pretty. Do the side and keep it even. <laughs> Okay, let's see. I'm gonna clean off my hand and I'm gonna swatch um, the shades that I didn't use in the palette on my hand so that way you guys can still see them. I'm definitely gonna be breaking out this palette more and playing with it more. I think pretty much everything I didn't use is a shimmer. <laughs> okay, that's pretty too. That's probably gonna go in my inner corner. <sighs> okay, so this like sparkly brown one, it's called Sweetness. It has some shimmer in it, but for the most part, it's like a matte with some shimmer in it. Even though in the pan, it looks like it'd be like a straight up, sh like a brown base with purple, purple-ish shimmer in it. That's what they look like. Aren't they freaking stunning? Okay, so I have my base on. We're going to go ahead and finish up the under eyes. Okay, so for the under eyes, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take Sunday Soiree, the lighter pink shade, or I guess mid-tone, and we're going to go underneath. Honestly, just gonna leave it like that it looks really cute with just that one shade which I, I never do okay so I'm gonna go off camera I'm gonna do liner lashes lips and all that jazz and I'll be right back okay so this is the finished eye look the lashes are just some crave lashes I think they're called a limoncello that I had cut in half and stacked on top of each other and then for the lip I used uh, the Kylie Cosmetics lip liner in autumn and that's all I have on my lips I don't have anything else but yeah guys I hope you guys like this video honestly everything ColourPop that I tried amazing I definitely recommend it don't forget to like this video hit that subscribe button and also turn on the bell so that way you get notified every time I upload a brand new video and thank you guys so much for watching bye <laughs>